What a great day to sew something wonderful. I'm Kia with Kia B. And this is Tech Guy from The Hive. And welcome back. We're so excited to be with you today. We have a very special video coming for you today. It's something that we don't typically do, but I saw this and loved it. And I made a mock-up of it and thought you guys would really enjoy it as well. So we did kind of a teaser in our floss tube earlier this week Mail about this call. product. And um, told you guys that we would be coming out with this special video. So Usborne Books and More is a phenomenal book company. We have been buying their books for our homeschool kids for as long as we've been homeschooling. And um, gosh, they have so many great books. A lot of probably the children's books that are in your uh, public library are from Usborne. A lot of school, hopefully, a lot of school libraries have a good amount of Usborne books. And... Um, I don't know, we just, we really like them. I don't sell these things or anything like that. Um, I just really like them, and we use them on the daily in our homeschool. Yes. So, when I saw this come across my desk, I knew I had to show it to you. So, this is a llama embroidery kit. They actually have several different embroidery kits. We just chose the llama. And so, I kind of wanted to take it out and give it a test drive and do the project and then come back with you guys. So I've actually already done that. So this kit retails for $12.99 and um, it is, I thought, okay, $12.99 for an embroidery kit. Um, more on the high side of an embroidery kit until I saw it and everything that you get within it and the amount of teaching that you can do to your niece or nephew or grandson Kids. or granddaughter or son or daughter or, you know, I mean, so many different neighbor. things. Da neighbor, yes. Um, and then I was like, oh, wow, this is Worth awesome. It. So one of the things we are so passionate about is spreading the love of quilting and the love of needle art in general. Recently, we've started uploading more cross stitch to our channel. And, um, you know, we just have this passion, I think, for teaching the love of that art. And I think this kit is wonderful for starting at such a young age. Yes. So let me show you the project. I actually stitched it up. It only took me about an hour, maybe. Um, I'm trying to find something to hold it up against so that you can see it really well. Okay, so this is the project. And don't worry, we're gonna do close-up shots of each of these things. But this is the product. It is uh, just a really cute little llama standing by a cactus with a sun motif around it. And it just makes a cute little wreath. This hoop is very interesting to me. So it uses tongue and groove. And so as you are putting in your fabric, it clips into the hoop and then just like a normal embroidery hoop, you tighten it right there. And so the thing I loved most about this wasn't just necessarily the project itself. It's a llama. It's super cute. That's all the rage right now are llamas and um, alpacas, unicorns and all mm -hmm. the things, right? Um, it was this book. This book, so this whole kit retails for $12.99 and I thought... Like, this book is totally worth that. And here's why. I don't want to give you uh, the pattern, so I'm going to be careful about what pages I flip to. But this book is going to teach you from all the way from spreading your thread and what that means of spreading your floss to tying a knot, how to start, how to do a loop start. Um, what a straight stitch is, a running stitch, and it comes with all these great pictures. And so um, I'm going to show you just this first page here that is a straight stitch, and this is going to show you exactly what that means, where to put uh, the straight stitch, where to put your needle, where to do all of the things. And so, um, I mean, it's just, it's awesome. It's really, really great. A V-shaped stitch, a fern stitch. What is the difference between a cross stitch and a back stitch? A French knot, untwisting your thread when it's gotten all twisted. And then it comes with the pattern, and it does the pattern in layers. So that as you're teaching your child, they're not looking at a chart and looking at um, you know, one chart that has six different colors on it, or in this case, it has three different colors on it. It takes the chart and it says, here's all the yellow thread. 
and then there's a separate chart. Here's where you put the green thread. And then here's a second chart. Here's where you put the pink thread. And when you're learning, I think that's really vital. Yes. Where yeah. was this when I started? Yeah, exactly. exactly. Um, and so here is kind of a picture of what that looks like when it's all finished, all done. And um, I'm going to maybe hold it back here. So it's absolutely so cute. So cute. So let me tell you what you get in this kit. You're going to get this book and it is 16 pages and it's a really like it's a good well quality illustrated good quality UBAM book that you would think of you get the embroidery hoop and then your pre-printed design on the cloth itself and it fits perfectly inside the hoop you get your own needle for this specific project and it comes just um, on a little piece of paper just like that and then you get all your floss and you get plenty of floss and here's why they want you to be able to hang your project in the embroidery hoop with the excess floss so we have the pink floss the green and the yellow and like I said it even shows the person how to separate the floss and what that means and why they do it and so um gosh I just love this kit I think it turned out really super cute for me it took maybe an hour to finish and uh, that was me reading the book and everything. So, I mean, it's super duper cute. I just it's love very it. Very simple read. Yes. Uh, very laid out. Yes. Uh, step by step with pictures. Right. And then the nice thing is Usborne has quick links. And in this book, there are links to websites where you can watch video clips with the person you're teaching um, on different embroidery skills. And then it gives you keywords and the website that you go to use that. And here's why I love that. We can all search on YouTube. If you're here watching this, that means you've either found it popped up on your YouTube, you got notified that we uploaded it, or you've done a search for something like this. So we can all do that. But do we want our six, seven, eight, nine, ten year olds to do a YouTube search for some things? Usborne gives this great platform where it is monitored as to what is being uploaded. And so there is a very specific website that you go to. I'm not going to share it right here because it is in the book. But um, it, there's a very specific website that you go to that's going to lead you to videos of different embroidery skills. They do that in a ton of their books, which is why... For instance, our science encyclopedia, there is a website that the kids can go to for that specific encyclopedia so that when they're learning about certain topics that I don't necessarily want them to search the internet for, uh, they have a safe place to do that. Yep. And so Usborne does a great job of that. So I know I feel like this is very commercially, but I love this and I think it's going to make a phenomenal Christmas gift for so Anybody you are wanting to teach this might, craft to. Might spark an interest or they yes. have an interest in it. Yes. Um, yeah, I think this is a great beginner. And, yeah. uh, you know, I was joking earlier, where was this when I started? Because there's some things I'm like, oh, that would yes. that would be great to know. Yes. So I'm going to just, because uh, we have a lot of cross-stitchers, I'm just going to read the instructions for cross-stitch so you can see how well it's laid out. So it's, you've got a picture and it says number one. Start with a straight stitch. So they're assuming you know how to do a straight stitch along a diagonal guide line like this. And then it shows you the picture. Number two, push the needle up from the back at the bottom of the other diagonal guide line like this. And then it shows you how to do it. And then number three, push the needle down at the end of the guide line to make an X. And so, it, I mean, it's so clearly very, laid very out. Clear. Yeah. So I love this. I think... I really do think it's going to make some great gifts, and honestly, I love it. I, I love it. Too. So, because I did love it so much, I, I got an extra it. one to give away for you guys. So, we've got one to give away. I've got um, all the links down below. My friend Ashley um, gave us this stuff to review and kind of give away, and so I've got all of her links down below. I want you guys to click on those and go take a look at what she's got this month, and like I said, there are other patterns that, um, instead of just the llama, I think they've got four or five other patterns that they're, they're, they're working with right now, yep. and they each come with their own book and own pattern which is great fantastic awesome options so we want to give this one away and um i'm thinking of a question what question i don't know so in our comment section when we do a giveaway we don't want you to say giveaway we don't want you to say free we don't want you to say anything like that what i would love for you to do is answer a question if you were to win this who would you teach your love of 
crafting in general, who would you want to teach this to? Awesome. And so, yeah, I'm, Love I'm interested. Yeah, for I think sure. the, the passion for needlework that we do, that we have, yeah. uh, we want to, you know, pass that or pay it forward. Yes, yes. Our uh, our nine year old is cross stitching a an American flag right yes. now on a piece of wood, um, and it's just awesome. It's great. He has a great time with it. He will sometimes sit. His attention span is very very short. Uh, but it's just really, really fun. So, okay, so we are going to keep this giveaway open until Thursday, September 26th. I got to get the date right. So we're going to leave this giveaway open until Thursday, September 26th, 2019, at which we are going to... Uh, just pick a random winner and we will reach out to you to get your address to send this out to you. How fun is that? Yes, I'm so excited. This project is so adorable, so cute. I love it. We're going to show you some close-ups of it so you make sure and get a good look at just how adorable this printed cross or this printed embroidery kit is. Awesome. So, all right. Well, thank you guys so much for joining us in the hive today and we will talk with you later. Bye.